Hey, welcome to the Flip Learning Professional Development course for October through probably December 2014 for Campus Guadalajara. I'm just going to give you a quick overview of what the course is about to give you an idea, um, settle any um, stress you have about it. Don't worry, you can do this in Spanish or English for your answers. I'll do my stuff in English because that's my native language. So let me give you a quick view of the course here. Um, I'm going to offer it in Schoology. So let me just close a couple extra tabs here so we don't got a whole bunch of stuff open. Um, so within Schoology, this is our course. Uh, if you've not used Schoology before, I'll give you a login here in a second. Um, actually, I'll just do it right now. So let's say you open a browser. You go to www.schoology.com. If you already have an account, that's great. If you don't have an account, I'll show you how to create one right now. You'll need a special access code, which you'll have in your email um, in order to log in. So I would have to sign up here because I'll pretend I'm a new person. Um, you probably want to sign up as an instructor, I think. Uh, uh, actually, no, sorry, as a student. So you want to sign up as a student and then you give that access code. The access code I already gave you. You'll put it in here, you'll hit continue, and then you'll have to register for um, to be a member of Schoology. I recommend using your ITSM account. Um, but you can use whatever you want. Once you get in there, you'll have access to the course. So let's take a look at what the course looks like. Here's the course. You'll see on the right, similar to any learning management system, you have your upcoming deadlines. And we have uh, actually seven. A submission number zero, which is really short. And then five um, larger submissions. And don't worry, they're not really that large. The big submission really is that last one where you're flipping the lesson and a wrap up which is my way of getting feedback. Really there's two things I want you to pay attention here. There's discussions and there is assignments. Uh, don't worry about these dates on the discussions. I'm going to modify this in a sec. Um, basically the idea is we're going to meet about once a week online. You can feel free to contact me any other time either directly via email or if you're on campus come and see me in my office. Uh, we'll talk more as we go uh, forward how, how to get contact with me and, and discuss what we're working on. But the main idea is the discussion of the week, whether it's in our video session that we're doing a weekly live video session or during the week, you should probably do in the discussion area. So this is where we're, where the discussions are happening. These are not marked, they're just I've got um, questions about the assignment or you have questions about the assignments. Just go in here for the discussion for each week. Uh, what, we're starting at week zero because I'm a computer scientist. Uh, so if you go to sub the assignments, these are the things you have to actually submit. Um, I need to actually delete that one, so why don't I just delete it right now. Delete that. It's a copy from the last um, assignment from the last course. So we've got six assignments. This is out of order because I cr just created this last one. Um, submission zero is a explanation of why are you taking this course? Why is it interesting to you? What do you already know about flip learning? And then we're going to go through the pillars of flip learning, flexible environment, learning culture, intentional content, professional educator. I've seeded um, what I think you should read or what I think you should um, watch on a YouTube video. But really what I want each of you to do is go deeper. Look at what's important to you, what's more interesting to you, um, but stay within that theme of the week. And then I want you to do two things write a like say one page essay type explanation it could be two it can be three as long as you want um, I think short and sweet is better and and as well as that as make a YouTube style video I want you to make videos because I want you to become comfortable making videos like this um, and publish them for all of the other students in the class to share you can publish them unlisted on YouTube or link them through Dropbox or some other method so all the classmates, the, the students or the teachers in the course can see what you're working on. So I want to create a sharing environment. Um, so we go through those fillers, or sorry, the pillars, and then we have a another thing I added this semester as opposed to the last summer course. I want you to plan a flip lesson. So that's the last submission. And then the last, last submission is actually just feedback for me where you're making a video reflecting on what happened over these two months and uh, and, and give me some feedback on the course as well as some reflections for yourself about what you learned. And that's really all there is to it. Um, and I'll see you online pretty soon. All right, thanks.